皆さん、こんにちは。And welcome to Shogo's podcast. So today's story is,、uh, is going to be actually be a question to you guys, something I want your opinions about. And my second daughter suddenly started crying at the beginning. But, anyways,、um, so recently we were actually considering trying to make a new video series, which is a day in the training of blah, blah, blah. So it could be a, a day in the training of a Yairo Ka or a Nihon Buyo Japanese traditional dancer, or it could be a Shakuhachi, it could be a Koto, it could be a.、Uh, Uh, all these kind of stuff, right? You know? And I really wanted to know.、Um, we're going to be making this series where basically we、uh, go along with the person who is training it. If it could be, for example, Kazu、uh, training at Yushinka, m maybe I'll be the interview,、um, per- interviewee. Wait, interviewee is the person interviewing? Or <laughs> I get confused all the time. But, anyways, I could go around following him and、uh, asking questions to the people who would like to answer me about why they train or what kind of training they do、um, as we film the actual training that they do. And And、um, for example, if it's no theater, for me, it's just me and my sensei. So、um, you can do a lot of filming of w- how we are taught and such. And I thought that'd be a really cool video series that we can do because usually you won't be able to see these kind of,、um, what should I say, things, right? I mean, like you can see the performances, you can see the stages, but behind all of those. You know, performances,、um, there's a lot of effort, you know, everyday training that goes on to make those perfect stages a reality, right? So I thought it'd be really cool if we can actually show you guys how we do it. And I really wanted to know if we're ever going to be making these video series. By the way, so far I think we'll be able to do、uh, No Theater, Yushinkan. I still need to ask my sensei for my first Duha style, which is the,、um, the, the Yairo, so w h i c h is the Asian Du. Um, the Koto sensei, well, we're not too sure. Shami sen,、mm, we'll definitely have to think more about it. And so, so far, confirmed is no theater, Yushin Khan, and probably Japanese traditional dancing. How do you mean Japanese traditional dancing? Th- these three will definitely be confirmed. And once we make these videos, I think it'll be easier to ask the other sensei、um, for making videos as well, because some people just can't imagine what the,、uh, the video filming is going to be like, and then they just have to say no to it, you know? So, I might be able to ask my Shakuhachi sensei for a,、uh, for a video as well. I need to ask him.、Um, There's a few rules within his class that he has to follow, and it might not allow him to, to、um, give me permission to do the video filming. But I think it's up to him if he can kind of、uh, slip through those rules. Maybe it'll be possible. But、um, of course, if, if it's going to be a video, eventually everyone will find out about it, right? So I have to ask him. But, anyways, I wanted to ask you if we're ever going to be making such video series of us going and training and you guys be watching us doing the training, what kind of parts would you be interested in? It'd be great if you can let me know if, if we're ever going to be watching this video. If, for example, if you're interested in the art, in the martial art, it could be the stage art, it could be the instrument. If you're interested in what parts would you want to see? Would you want us to?、Um, Uh, ask the senseis, for example, certain questions. What are, do, would you like us to ask more questions to the students, other students, if there are any? Or do you want us to、uh, film part, like, specific parts of the training? Or,、um, yeah, if you can give us more information,、um, I really want to be fully prepared for this video because, you know, we can't, what should I say,、um, do this many, many times, right? I want to be, I want to make the best video、yeah, if we're going to be filming this once. And we're going to be having to ask our instructors, our senseis, a lot for.、Uh, For help, you know, for this filming. So, I don't want to, I want to make the best of it basically. Yeah, so it'd be great if you can let me know about your opinions. And、um, yeah, basically, this the story of today is just is just it. And it must, it's already, it's all, it has only been four minutes so far. So, I'm going to be adding a little bit of、um, <laughs> extra stories. This is not、uh, related to anything about today's topic, I guess. But I actually have been really, really thankful. That、uh, some people have already started to support me on Ko fi. I think maybe at the time this podcast is coming out, maybe the Ko fi video on my main channel has already been posted, but I'm really grateful because all I did is make one podcast on video and also I talked about it a few times in my morning Instagram live streams, but actually, I think. Probably already six, seven people have already、um, donated to me, and I really, really appreciate it. And I'm really happy to say that by the time I actually officially announce my new Ko fi page, which is really close to a Patreon page, by the way, for those of you who don't know, it's a donation website where you can donate money to people who you want to support. And right now, my goal is to raise money to go to school to become a Japanese language teacher and instructor. So there's a license, basically.、Um, so I really want to get that, you know? 
And uh, yeah, I'm just really grateful that a lot of people are already supporting me. And I'm trying to think of many ways to try to promote the Kofi page until the end of this year because I do have a time limit. It's, it's until the, at the end of this year that I try to achieve this. Um, it was uh, 60,000 um, yen, I think. 60,000 yen, I believe. Yes, that's right, right? 6,000. 60,000, 600,000. Yeah, 600,000 yen. I always try to tend to mix that up together with uh, US dollars. But in US dollars, if it was uh, $1 was 100 yen, it'd be $6,000, yeah. But because, you know, yen is very cheap right now, it's much, much um, smaller, the number is much smaller than that. But I'm trying to achieve that by the end of this year. But hopefully, um, I'll be able to maybe achieve at least 25% um, at the end of this September. Mm -hmm. And we'll see how it goes from October, to November, and December. But yeah, it would be great if you guys can support me that so I can go to, to school to be able to become a Japanese uh, language instructor. And I really hope you can look forward to it. I'm going to be talking about it in the main video. You, you might have already heard me talking about this, but there's going to be a lot of stuff that I'll be able to do mm -hmm. if once I get that. More videos, more content, more live streams. And uh, yeah, um, so yeah, actually, I'm going to be making more videos related to learning Japanese, maybe introducing some applications, trying it out, uh, telling you guys about my opinions, and all this kind of stuff. Um, yeah, I'll, I'm trying to make more videos before I actually be able to um, take the classes to become an instructor. So I really hope you can look forward to that too. Okay, so then lastly, again, today's main part is not about that. Yeah, today's main part is about um, what you would like to see or what you'd like to learn more if you're ever going to be seeing us um, the training places, the training houses, or um, our actual training. It'd be great if you can let me know what parts you'd like to more like to see more in detail. Questions or um, parts of the scenes and such. Please let me know in the comments, and I will absolutely make it a reality in the videos that we make. So then, everyone, as I always say, the ultimate goal of my life is to make all Japan lovers dreams come true. So I know there's a lot of people studying Japanese, willing to come to Japan to study, travel, work, or even train our traditional culture and such. However, I am very afraid that Japan will not be able to make everyone's dreams come true in the future because we're facing a lot of social problems, we are losing our traditional culture, and the younger generations who are supposed to be carrying on the good things about Japan are dying because of all the social issues being shoved against them. So I really want to dedicate my life trying to make Japan a better place. I want to try to solve the social problems, preserve and evolve traditional culture, and also help out the younger generations so they can have a brighter future. And do this, the nearest goal I have right now is to achieve 2 million subscribers by January 2023 on our main channel. So our likes and comments to help to boost our videos. New viewers have never seen our channel before. So it'd be great if you can help us out. And also, yes, achieving, raising 600,000 yen by the end of this year too through Kofi, a donation website for me to become a Japanese language instructor too. So it'd be great if you can take a look at the description box and support me and help me out. Okay, then thank you so much guys. I hope you can look forward to the next podcast too. Have a nice day.